AITA, my mother-in-law is charging my husband and I more rent because she needs the money. Three years ago my mother-in-law bought a home that was a 1031 exchange. We mutually agreed that the home she purchased my husband and I would live in and pay the mortgage. The house was a huge fixer-upper from the 1960s that needed a full renovation. While the bathrooms still haven't been completed about 80% of the work has been completed and we've personally spent about $50,000 in renovations and are anticipating to spend another $20,000 to $30,000. The house has made about $100 million in equity. Our goal was to live in this house for at least 5 years and after that we talked about selling it and doing another 1031 exchange into a larger house. Here's where the plans shifted. About 2 years ago she was diagnosed with stage 4 cancer. While we all hope her cancer will be in a place of a maintenance she has declined dramatically. She has now moved into a phrase where she needs a caregiver almost full time to function and the cancer has spread to multiple organs. Here's where I'm having trouble. Yesterday she calls my husband telling him that next month we need to start paying an additional $500 a month and then in a few months after that $1,000 more. Mind you we pay the entire mortgage so this extra income would be going straight to her. The house we live in could fetch an extra $500 a month if renovations were complete and there aren't. I guess I'm infuriated because she wouldn't tell my husband why we needed to pay this money right away and she expected it. I think about my parents and they would never charge a dime more on the mortgage if they were in this situation. Granted, this is not the situation, but adding $500 slash dollar one zero 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 more a month is significant i just don't have those funds laying around my husband was mortified about the phone call and honestly taken back that his mother suggested it we can only come up with the reason she needs this money is because she's hired a caregiver and would be running through her retirement fund at an expedited pace while i'm more than happy to help my mother-in-law pay medical bills i'm baffled by this stark request which she is making Obviously, my emotions are high, but I'm starting to resent her and that why I need more opinions to see it in a different light. My husband did phrase it to look at it from an alternative view that we would inherit the house no matter what, and that we have to do this because his mother needs the help. Update, the house is in a trust. She also owns a mobile home and has two children, my husband and his brother, but in the trust everything is written as 50 50ths. AITA for telling him, no, don't agree to the $500 slash $1000, we need to have a further conversation of the reasoning and a concrete date that we all mutually agree on and negotiate the number?